In this video we show how to connect a stepper motor that is already wired up to a screw terminal. For this we have another tutorial. We connect the pre-wired stepper motors to Cobra electronic board, computer and power supply. We start with board not connected to power or computer, but just the motor. Plug in any of the exits on the rear side, you may have one, two, three, four, or five. In this case, we have three. Plug the motor in. Please note when I plug in or remove motor, board power must be off. Never connect or disconnect the motor with power on. So, board unpowered, I connected the stepper motor. Now, I will do this simple test. I rotate the shaft by hand. The motor will work as a power generator, insert energy into the board. The driver chip will discharge extra power into the power rails. Power rails will light up the LED here. So, as you rotate the shaft, the LED will light up. You have moderate mm, friction here, mm, moderate resistive torque because it's just the energy that the board uses to power light on the LED, LED. And notice also that the LED lights up instantly and then shut off slowly. This is sort of confirmation that you did a good job at uh, wiring up the motor. If this is runs freely and the LED doesn't light on, or if it is completely stuck, that is extremely hard to rotate, then you wired something incorrectly. Don't power on the board, but recheck wiring. Oh, you may, if you have more motors, just connect the other two and check again. Only if this test succeeds, that you have this behavior on the LED, you can connect computer. This can be direct to printer port or with a UC100 CNC motion controller which has own CPU and USB connection. Just connect here and we are ready to use a power supply from this side to mains. We have this kind of plug in Italy, you may have Shuko or American style. When I plug it in, the LED on power supply will light on. And I will do another uh, test without the motor. Just insert supply here, be sure that it is plus on left and minus on right side. As it says here, supply plus and minus, plus is near the edge of the board. You put in and then remove and look at the LED. It lights on and then slowly off. In this one, slowly off. And it is okay. Didn't see any fire. Okay. And we are okay again on power off. If this doesn't work like this, please contact us because there, may, there can be an issue. Stepper motor bus be connected and disconnected only when power is off. So we connected the stepper motor. And now we can connect power. And you notice the shaft of the stepper motor is stuck because it's held in position by the board. We assume, assume you already configured soft control software. This is another tutorial. And then now I use left and right key on keyboard to control X axis. And motor shaft will rotate.
left and right. So this confirms oh, it's working great. Right. 